Hi, Andrew Kolokoff here. I am speaking about today, our have, be, do, have, Monday, Wednesday, Monday Tuesday, Wednesday. Um, we all know we want nice things. We want a nice car, a house. We want to make a lot of money. We want to travel. Um, what I would recommend, a lot of people set their goals based on what their desires are. And a lot of times our desires are things that we think we want, but we don't really need. It, it feeds something inside of us that is insatiable, that we need to actually better know ourselves why we really want it. So a little tip for those who make vision boards, who those who set goals and work their way backwards from those goals. I would highly recommend you do what a technique called the five whys. If you have something you want to have, ask yourself five whys you want it. Why, like, why do I really want this? Well, I want it because I, could, I can have a better life. Well, why could you have a better life? Well, I could have a better life because, you know, of whatever. Um, and then. So ask yourself the five whys. One of the things I, when I coach people is they think, okay, we're gonna get started, let's set up our goals and let's, you're gonna keep me accountable and we're gonna get going. And I'm like, no, I don't think you know yourself well enough yet. I certainly don't knew, know you well enough yet to know if the goals that we're setting are the right goals to set. So this week's have is make sure that what your desires are of those things you wanna have are really the right things um, and that they are really those things that are gonna fill you up and make you feel um, more accomplished, happier. You know, happiness comes from inside. It doesn't come from a thing. Um, it comes from the journey and how you live the journey towards the accomplishment. So anyway, five whys, try it out. I think you'll like it. Um, and you can apply that to anything in your life, not just about having. Ask yourself the five whys about anything. You'll find that it will likely get you to the root of why anything in your life. So thanks for listening. And remember, it's good business to make a difference in the lives of those we do business with and seek business from.